Good morning, you guys. It's currently early, early in the morning on Thanksgiving morning. So, happy Thanksgiving, you guys. It's officially time to start listening to all of the Christmas music. But, real quick, I can't stay long and chat because I'm in the parking lot at the gym. I am, let me show ya. Yes, I am at Metro Fitness and it is time for a Thanksgiving workout and I need to go in right now so I'll fill you guys in on the details later. All right, you guys, I made it. <laughs> I almost don't even have words because that workout was so, so stinking intense. All of his workouts are. Boot camps are always just the most intense workout of the week for me. But today, he took it to a whole nother level. I've never had <laughs> a workout like make me emotional because I was just through the whole thing like, okay, just one more, I can do it, I can do it, one more, don't puke, you've got this. And it was like an hour and like 18 minutes, I think. It was really intense. I made it, I lived, I kept everything down. We made it. Um, yeah, I think I'm 13 weeks into prep too, so. That felt really great with not much anything in my body right now, but I made it. Um, that was my first ever Thanksgiving boot camp, and it was wonderful. But anyways, it's 8:45 now. Um, I just pulled into my apartment. I could not talk at the gym because I just like my throat even hurts from breathing so hard. But um, I need to go shower because I was dripping. Um, so I'm gonna shower, and then. I have like a list of things that need to get done. So it's 8.45 and I need to be at the Tanner's house for Thanksgiving lunch at one o'clock and I still have several desserts. Oh shoot, I need to go get a pie crust because I don't think I have the ingredients to make it. I made like the filling for the pie last night and then I thawed out some cookies, the cookie dough that I made so I need to actually roll them up and make them into ginger snaps. And then I have a pumpkin roll to make and I need to find a pie crust, so. I need to do that and then yeah I need to finish working on my last vlog and get it uploaded before I run over and then yeah Alex and I might go shopping later today for our ingredients for our bake-off or we might get our Christmas tree I don't know there's a lot of options I'm super pumped I don't have to go back until to work until Monday like I was saying yesterday so it's a good day I'm feeling extra thankful happy Thanksgiving to you guys be prepared for every single vlog now for a while to have Christmas music, finally. All right, I'm gonna go shower. Also, we are dog sitting this week, so if you see a little pooch running around, that's that's what it is, it's not our dog. So, all right, I'll see you guys later. All right, you guys, all the desserts are finally done. I got my makeup done. I just need to do my hair and change. Alex and I leave in about an hour, I think, or like 45 minutes. But real quick, show you guys the desserts. Once again, the pumpkin roll pie crust and then I'm gonna add this chocolate pudding that I made I made it last night and refrigerated it and then that just goes right into the pie and then you put some whipped cream on top but there's the cookies um I know I show you guys in literally all of my vlogs now but I'm getting ready hold on to take my daily greens by morphogen nutrition still a lifesaver I'm still Super happy with their products. Um, I'm going to be ordering a few different ones to try. I'm going to order them tomorrow. They don't, um, they don't do any Black Friday sales because they already don't. There's never... <clears throat> sorry. <clears throat> My voice has been so weird since training this morning. Um, anyways, they don't do a shipping fee. And then you can always use discount codes. So they don't run any Black Friday deals. But I've been waiting to order until payday because we do a monthly budget and I try to order my supplements um, at the beginning of the month. So yeah, I'll probably order Friday or Saturday and I don't need any more greens this time but I'm gonna try a few different things. Um, I'd like to get a pump product and then I don't know what else. Um, but anyways, yeah, I'm gonna take that my greens real quick and work on editing my past vlogs so I can get it out today so that the holiday vlogs have officially started. But after that, yeah, we're gonna go to uh, my family's house. Well, my in-laws, which is my family. I'm just confusing myself right now. But anyways, yeah, um, that's about it.
our way to his family's house for Thanksgiving. Are you super excited to eat all the food? <laughs> I can only ever get you to say like one word, one word responses. At some point, he's gonna get less awkward on camera and chat with you guys. <laughs> but we have all the desserts loaded up in the car and I just realized I forgot my scale. That's okay. I guess I'll be eyeballing it today. My main untracked like Thanksgiving meal is on Saturday with my family. I want to just take one this year. So I have to wait a few more days before I get to just eat. But I, I think I said it before, I am just gonna like track generic things today and then guess on how much of it I ate, which should be okay. I'm still, I think like 18 weeks away from the show day, 18 or 17, something like that, but plenty. So, yes, I'll fill you guys in on everything later. Good morning, you guys. It's officially Christmas season and I am freaking out with excitement. Yesterday was Thanksgiving, which means it's time to Christmas music all day, every single day. Alex is gonna die because he doesn't like Christmas music. But you guys, this is my absolute freaking favorite time of year and I'm so pumped up. My morning's been a little bit crazy. Um, I've just been getting ready. I have all day today off, like I've said before. But I've honestly just slept in. I uploaded my last vlog. I ordered some things up for Black Friday and I got ready and I'm headed to do a really quick Costco shop and then we are off to meet some friends for coffee. So it's gonna be a good day. I'm gonna jam to my holiday music. Christmas music is the best ever. So let's go start this season. You guys, that was some super speedy shopping. As you saw, all I got was chicken breast, it was on sale, and chicken thighs, and, oh gosh, I'm putting buns on my radio. And, um, <laughs> sorry, I'm getting so distracted. Coffee. Um, we get a lot of free coffee from my friend because she works at Starbucks, but we just get like the fresh beans to grind. So on days that we're in a hurry, we use the Keurig cups. So yeah, I had a little bit more time than I thought it would. I need to be leaving to go meet my friend for coffee in about 20 minutes. And the grocery store all days is right next door, so I'm probably just gonna pop in there real quick so that I am done with my main grocery shopping for the day. And then Alex and I are gonna go grocery shopping this evening and get ingredients for our bake up, bake up, bake off challenge that we are doing tonight and we are gonna be filming it. This is like our traditional thing now. We did it last year and I wanna do it like every stinking year because it's my favorite thing ever to do with him. So yeah, I'm gonna run in Aldi's and get just a few things for the week and then go meet for coffee. So I just met with Megan a little bit ago. It's actually like 2.40 now. And I met with her and then I ran back home and grabbed something to eat real quick because I realized I hadn't eaten a single bite all day and I've had like three cups of coffee. But yeah, I just stopped at home. Alex had actually ran and gotten our Christmas tree while I was gone. And so we got it all set up at the house. Like we haven't decorated or anything yet, but we got it all set up so that's really fun. And um, I'm gonna meet Claire at the grocery store and we're gonna get stuff for Alex and I's bake off tonight. So I'm super pumped about that and I'm really excited to record it because it's like one of my favorite memories and we didn't record it last year. But anyways, yeah, I'm just gonna run to the grocery store, meet up with her and then head back and we're gonna decorate our tree and start baking. But I'm currently munching on these little yogurt melts so it's kind of an embarrassing snack because they're like sold in the baby food aisle which I'm like not a fan of people that just eat baby food stuff because they're low calorie but these are just yogurt melts and I honestly just love the flavor and I haven't found them in the adult section anywhere so yeah I get them from Aldi's and they're like $1.79 and it's like four servings and I just munch them occasionally but yeah I just track out a serving and then like eat a serving every once in a while and they're delicious so 
Don't judge me for my baby food snack. But yeah, <laughs> I'm enjoying them while I'm not on a meal plan. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna run to the store and meet with her because I'm supposed to be there in 10 minutes. I gotta go. All right, bye guys. like the last 20 minutes looking for marsipone cheese and we can't find it anywhere and I'm getting really flustered. Marsipan. <laughs> it's like marsipone, marsipan. I don't know. <laughs> we both are. It's supposed to be in a little container and we can't find it and we've been wandering all over the store. I quit. I quit. All right you guys. I'm finally back home. That was such a frustrating process. Claire and I went to Kroger and like we were saying we could not find that mascarpone cheese. I don't know how to say it. We couldn't find it anywhere. We walked in circles for like 15 minutes just for the cheese and never found it. Then I went to Trader Joe's and they were sold out. I even asked somebody for help. So then I went all the way to Giant Eagle past my apartment and paid six dollars for a little tiny type of cheese. So that was fun. And then Alex and I got back and we were decorating the Christmas tree. And half the lights work. It's just been my day. I was literally just at three stores. I could have gotten lights. So he just left because he could see that I was like getting to the point where nothing is working. So he's being a love and going out and getting it while I work on his dinner. I have chicken going. I'm going to make buffalo chicken dip for him. And then we're going to decorate and start our great Tanner Bake Off. So I'm really excited. You guys, Alex just called me because he just had a bill bar um, on his way because he wanted a quick snack. And so I had two other protein bars that somebody had given me. And one was a Quest bar and then the other one was a pure protein bar, I think. But Alex has a nut allergy, so he cannot have any bars with nuts. And Bilt Bars do not contain any tree nuts. Um, so anyways, that was the only bar he could have. So he picked through and just grabbed um, one of the, the dark chocolate orange cream bar. And he called me on the phone just because he couldn't believe how good they were. I wasn't lying. I told you guys they're phenomenal. So if you want to try them... Do it because I'm not just the only one that likes them. So I just had to tell you guys real quick because I thought that was funny that he literally called me on the phone while I was driving just to tell me that Bill Bars are pretty freaking great. So that's it. You guys, it is officially time for the Great Tanner Bake Off. We've been waiting a year for this day. It's gonna take a hot minute though. <laughs> I've been waiting a year for it. <laughs> Are you still getting your recipe yet? Oh yeah. <laughs> but it's gonna be a long process. It's 7.30, we have one pan for six layers. So it's gonna, it's gonna be a long night. But, five layers. Oh, you're still only two layers? Mine's three. But Smart. all of my family votes on this at Thanksgiving, which we are doing tomorrow on Saturday. And mine is going to be a three-layer salted caramel cake. And then what's yours, babe? Um, two-layer coffee layer cake. His honestly sounds a little bit better, but I was always. between... <laughs> Last year I did a three-layer carrot cake, and he did a chocolate ganache cake. I think his kind of won. But yeah, it won. But anyways, um, this year I changed to a salted caramel cake and he's doing a coffee cake. So, we shall see.
think about the blend of coffee you're going to use? No, I think it has. You should have thought about the blend. I thought about the blend. Yeah, you just said get instant espresso. Well, you guys, I officially decided I'm pitching it. It's the most absolute disaster. I've never had anything happen like this. Apparently, I can't bake under pressure, so we're counting on Alex's dessert to turn out better because we need to bring something tomorrow. Good. You guys, there's a reason that Alex's is going to turn out better than mine. He's measuring it. I clearly lost this year. Um, I threw three layers in the trash can, and I have my final layer right here. I just want to say, you're the champ. You. Are... And I haven't even baked anything yet. <laughs> well, mine's in the trash can. <laughs> I'm gonna have to make cookies for tomorrow because this is sad. I honestly, I have no idea what happened. I think the pressure got to me. I also don't know. Yeah, I literally have no idea how you can ruin something this badly. Yeah, it's unfortunate. Just some honey. I probably wouldn't be asking me for advice. So it look like about half there. Yeah. Mm. Looks like halfish to me. Yeah. It's also like after 10 o'clock now, so it's been hours. 